Here we come again, battle mode, doom eternal. <laughs> Caught him out with the fist there. No, that's not <laughs> work out what you're doing. So no, yeah, you're right, doom uh, eternal. It is. A, yeah. a new overview the gameplay. the multiplayer, yes. The multiplayer. The multiplayer yeah. overview gameplay trailer reaction coming right in for doom eternal. Yeah. I think we've said that already. We yeah. certainly have. It's coming out in November. November 22nd. And we've seen, yes. a, little, we've seen a little bit of this, all right? And it, uh, yeah, it's looking pretty sweet, I must admit. Uh, we are the old folk here who used to play the old Doom back when it's like, I don't know. Corridors. Corridors. Yeah, with, yeah. Uh, just walls. That was pretty well it. Yeah, no it? monsters, just walls. Yeah. Just walk through the corridors of the maze. Yeah. 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 So, no, um, we've loved the look of this so far. Mm. So, this uh, battle mode, I know nothing about it. So, it's going to be intriguing to see what this overview so, narration yes. is going to be. Should we go for it? Let's take a look. Welcome to Doom Eternal's battle mode. This two versus one multiplayer gives players the chance to experience the fast, aggressive fun of single player with their friends. With five playable demons and six unique maps at launch, battle That's mode a is lot. a whole new way to play Doom. Sixteen Start, maps. Let's take a closer look at its playable character. Which is six? Must have six then. Must have six. No, the most versatile and agile demons. His jetpack and dash allow you to move quickly <laughs> through the environment. What's that? Shoulder mounted Daisy. rockets deliver consistent firepower. I think so. While his special attack, the Daisy Rabbit, barrage, <laughs> delivers heavy, <laughs> long-range damage. Oh yeah! Oh. His ability to fly gives him a bird's-eye view, oh. making it easier to track the Slayer and attack from the air. But that makes him more vulnerable when he's not using his rechargeable soul shield. Oh. The Mancubus. Big, beefy, and badass. Kevin, what are you doing there? Ah, yeah, comedy, aren't you? <laughs> tons of health. All of which make him lethal in a close quarters fight with the Slayer. While he's not the most mobile demon, his smoke bombs can obscure his position or flush out an elusive Slayer. <laughs> <laughs> But demon strategy goes beyond their individual abilities. All the demons in battle mode can drop hazards that damage the Slayer, as well as summon different combinations of AI-controlled demons that behave and fight just like you expect from the campaign. Dropping hazards and summoning demons is controlled through a summoning wheel, allowing you to use these critical tools quickly when under fire. I'm liking the okay. interface on this. Sort of a menu wheel, but they're calling it a summoning wheel. Mode, players take control of a fully loaded Slayer with all his guns. Fully mind. loaded. Yeah, fully loaded. Fully loaded. Yeah. Just like in single player, the Slayer must aggressively manage not the, just the demons in the arena, the graphics of the guns, but also their resources. Glory kill demons to replenish health. Oh. <laughs> to gain ammo. <laughs> to add armor. But be aware, each demon player has a slow charging ability. I'm pretty sure it's got the BFG gun in there, isn't a short it? Time during the round. <laughs> a perfectly timed resource block can put the Slayer on the ropes. Battle mode is all about fast paced fun, but the mode's gameplay goes beyond character abilities to create moments of incredible pacing and drama. Take something simple like player outlines. Demons can always see the Slayer, even through walls. But if the Slayer is able to break line of sight, his outline vanishes. <laughs> Each arena has been designed to allow a clever Slayer to use the environment to become invisible and then flank the demons. Mm. This can change the pace of a match from a head-to-head -head brawl to a game That's of That's good. Now. I don't mind that, actually. To a Took him down really quickly, then back there. To a brawl. I was like a every bar, every shot. It's also designed with two portals facing each other at opposite ends Ooh. that can only be used by the Slayer. As Slayers learn to use the portals to flank the demons, the tactic can be countered by demon players who... Ah, oh, yes! Yeah. I love Turn that area. area. Yeah. Working together is critical for the demons. When alone, a player demon doesn't typically stand a chance against a Slayer with all his weapons and speed. So slayers try to isolate a demon, take it out, and move on to the next. The demons can counter by staying close and working together. Well, yeah, team play. There are also important strategies for the slayer to master. 
In the air, the Slayer is tough to hit, and the arenas have been designed with jump pads and monkey bars that a Slayer can use to traverse from one portal to the other without touching the ground. <laughs> this actually looks like fun. Damage to the demon players. Of course, the Slayer's need for ammo, armor, and health bring him back to the ground. So when he lands to chainsaw an enemy for more ammo, demon players can launch a coordinated attack. One of the most dramatic moments in every round is when a demon dies. Once the Slayer has eliminated one demon, a respawn timer begins. And the Slayer has 20 seconds to eliminate the other demon to win the round. Ah! If he fails, the dead demon player rejoins the fight. Let's go This quickly turns an all-out battle into a tense game of hide-and-seek. Rounds are won when either the Slayer is killed or both player-controlled demons are killed. But strategy extends between rounds as well. Hmm. Players choose upgrades, it's abilities, good. and even super weapons in later rounds. In a best of five match, if either side can win just one round, they gain access to power items, like player demons being able to summon the Baron of Hell, <laughs> or Slayers gaining the BFG. There you go! Oh, there there you go. Is. Battle mode is designed Brilliant. to be a fresh, competitive experience that's full of drama and deep strategies. After launch, all players can expect additional playable demons and maps for free. We hope free. you join us in Raising Hell wow. and Doom Eternal's battle mode on November 22nd. I will go as far as say that mm. actually sounds and looks like a right laugh. Get a fully loaded yeah. Slayer. I mean, who would yeah. you rather be? Would you rather be one of the demons or Slayer? Uh -huh. I mean, 2v1. Now, I get the fact that the Slayer is going to be more OP compared to the two demons, but with good team play going in it. It's got the advantage of being able to, like, it's got, like, a double in it, which will appear or disappear. You've got to take two of them out within so many seconds. 20 seconds. I know, yeah. otherwise they respawn yeah. back into the contest. Yeah, it's got my favourite gun. Well, a lot of people's favourite gun. Yeah, I can't I'm really, not like going to be able to use it very well. I can't say. <laughs> That's true. Loving the portal um, idea, how you can just go through a portal and then respawn in a different area. I don't know. I'm not, I, just, I don't know. That's, that's clever. I'm like, yeah, I'm like the way they kept it. It's kind of, I mean, it's got some brilliant graphics, but it's got that arcadey feel sometimes when you're in watching the game play on it, which makes it a bit more intense, to be honest. I used to be on the old arcade machines and you really feel like you, you've got to win. And... <sighs> we didn't say no more. It is coming yeah. out in a few months' time, obviously, for so PC, say, PS4, yeah, Xbox. 20, 22nd November, so. Nintendo Switch, yeah. Yeah, that would be interesting. Man. It will indeed. Uh, let us know your thoughts of Doom Eternal in the comments below, and more importantly, the battle mode. That's what I want to know more about. <laughs> so. Other than that, thank you for joining us, and we'll see you in the next one. Catch you on the flip side.